movieweb.com. Well, I, I want to have a little chat with you. Uh, do we have to? I found the sock in the laundry. Oh, Jesus, Mom, put that away. So, do you want to do it? The times may have changed. Rob, are we on for seventh period? Oh, yeah. But one thing remains the same. How did you know I like to be spanked? <laughs> American Pie is back with an all-new, unrated movie. This is the Bible. This thing goes back decades. This is exactly what we need to finally get late. They just found the playbook of their sexual dreams. We need to reconstruct the Bible. I'm in, all right? I'm in. Now, to save it... Hello? Are you the one who created the Bible? No, that would be God. Tell me the first time you remember seeing an American Pie film or the first time you became aware of the franchise. Ooh, that's a good question. Damn, okay. I gotta think about this. Um, I guess I became aware of it when it came out um, on DVD, and I guess I was, how old was I? I was probably 13 years old when it came out on DVD. You know, really ripe, wanting to see some nudity. And uh, I think I might, I, I think I may have caught it on Comedy Central a few times. They must have aired it. And I remember thinking, wow, I really want to see the uncensored version and not this crappy edited version for TV. So I, uh, but, but then um, it, it just exploded. It came out of nowhere, you know? And uh, I never, after the first one, I, 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 I didn't really watch the next two or you know, after that, but you know, when I got this movie, I went back and you know, they gave us all the DVDs in a big pack. So I went back and I watched the first three and I was like, these are really funny actually. So yeah, okay, I guess my reaction when it first came out was, Wow, I really want to see the actual version, and this looks really funny. Well, my parents would not let me see the movie, and so I remember begging them to see it in theaters because it was the cool thing to do. Everyone was going to see this movie. Um, so then I actually, once it came out on DVD, had my friend rent it, and I went over and spent the night at her house, and we watched it um, uh, on her television there. And my, I don't know, hi, Mom and Dad, I guess they know now <laughs> that I watched it um, then, but it was, yeah, I remember when it came out, it was like, Huge. Yeah, American Pie was part of my youth, you know. I was in high school when the first one came out, and, um, you know, it was before the internet was really big. I uh, still liked the dial-up mode, and you couldn't really rub one out to any internet porn, so American Pie was kind of this revolutionary, risque, raunchy comedy that everybody was talking about. And uh, so it was kind of a big deal when I was a kid, so, you know, to be a part of the franchise is, uh, is kind of a cool thing. I had not seen any of the American Pie movies. Um, Universal uh, sent a package with all of them, and I sat down over a weekend and watched, you know, all of them. And uh, I fell in love at that moment with with Pi. I, uh, is they're a lot of fun. You know, the first two are just awesome, absolutely awesome. And uh, you know, it was it was after I sat down and watched them, it was really exciting to to know that I was going to be part of you know such a great franchise. I don't know how old I was, uh, but. I, I was, you know, I was a diehard fan um, from the first movie. Uh, it was, you know, something that you, well, that I don't know if you did, but I, that I grew up with, you know what I mean? It was sort of like this new sort of very, you know, I don't want to say innovative, comedy that was sort of daring in a way that you know so a lot of comedies haven't gone there yet so it sort of paved the way for for a lot of us to have a really fun time on camera first time I saw an American Pie film uh, my brother was having a party at our house and he was also supposed to be babysitting me he turned it on and I walked downstairs because I walked downstairs a lot when I wasn't supposed to, and um, I got to see my first pair of breastesses, and they were beautiful. It was Shannon and Elizabeth's, and uh, yeah, it was it was a lot of firsts for me, um, but only good things, only good things. I remember being too young to get in, um, and I remember having a fake ID and getting denied at the Park in Tilford movie theater. Yes, I am Canadian. Um, yeah, so I remember going, getting denied, and. Um, 
they wouldn't let me in and I was like Grr. and so I kept going back and I think the third time I don't know what happened some you know the guys let us in and didn't look too closely at the ID that I had but yeah I remember just fully going and like sneaking into this movie and thinking oh my god I'm being so naughty like American Pie and just being like jaw dropping through the whole movie because it was the first movie to do any of those things and be so risque with like you know high school kids so it was pretty cool so tell me about your stifler. Is it yeah. the same stifler from the original? Is it a cousin or a younger yeah, brother? Yeah, Scott or? Stifler, he's a cousin. What I try to do is bring my own take to it, you know. Um, I just tried to be a little bit different with it, bring my own individuality to it, and um, you know, keep the essence of the character. You know, he's still, he's still kind of, a, kind of a jackass, big idiot, class clown, guy you love to hate, hate to love type of thing. And um, you know, I just, at the end of the day, just wanted to have a lot of fun with it, and um, let the beast out of his cage a little bit. You know, just be a total wild man. And everything that fans look for in American Pie movie, the jokes, the comedy, the sex. The it's, uh, it's, it's definitely all there. Uh, you know, I've been, I've been talking a lot about it, and it's this really weird place that they've found with this film. You know, on the one hand, it kind of is the raunchiest of, of all of the Pie movies, you know? So if that's your thing, that's in there. You know, we have the, you know, all the good <laughs> stuff. But there's also, we cranked the heart on it, you know, way up. Um, I think it's back sort of in the in the genre of the first one um, you know the characters are very relatable you really do feel for them so when the jokes happen it's actually funnier because you know you have these characters that you suddenly feel like you're part of and you know you're, you're part of that that little trio of, of guys running around you know and uh, it makes the jokes funnier and the tender moments really touch home you know uh, I think far more than than maybe the, the last few had. The, the, this film in particular has, has more than just, it, it, it has the nudity, it, it, it has all the stuff that you want, but it actually has heart. It's like, uh, it's like if you watch a porn with a story that you actually, you actually get into, you know, yeah. although it's not, you, you know what I mean. This one definitely connects to a broader audience because each girl that they like that has a storyline in this one like actually has a storyline that's relatable. Dana, uh, Jen Holland who plays Ashley and Heidi, they're all you all know these girls. You all know exactly what they were like in high school and everyone can see themselves in all three of them. So, I think for girls especially who are growing up and are having to deal with the same issues they do in the movie, they'll really be able to connect to this one and it's also really sweet love stories as well. There's a heart to it that the other ones um, didn't have as much that this one does. We, we we have boobs, we have jokes, we have boobs that tell jokes, um, we have boobs like me and Brandon Hardesty, and we also have Jen Holland, Melanie Papalia, and a host of other girls that you don't need to know their names, because they just have fantastic chests. So everything that you everything, expect. In everything that you could expect from an American Pie is in this American Pie. This book is a powerful weapon. Use it for good. This winter, I really like you. I feel the same way. You going to Stifler's house tonight? Ladies! Tonight, boys, is the night. You become a man. It's the hottest oh, slice yet. American Pie presents The Book of Love, unrated. Did you ever try making love to a peanut butter sandwich? Nothing comes close. <laughs>